Hey, hey, YouTube. Sean G back with another video. You guys, I could not leave not making a video, which may be my last video for 2019. I said earlier in the video that I was going to do a, um, a goodie challenge or a video challenge. But it's called, <laughs> it's called a goodie jar. And for you all that don't know what a goodie jar is, I use mine as an uh, example. I like Tootsie Rolls. So I made my goodie jar from my Tootsie Roll can. You guys can see it says in here, it may be reading backwards to you all. It says goodie jar. 2020 and I put my goodies in this jar I thought I started with three of them on what I want to accomplish or make my way to accomplishing for the year 2020 I'm gonna leave 19 I mean leave 2019 where it is I don't know why I want to keep saying 1999 <laughs> but anywho, I want to leave 2019 where it is and start focusing on where I want the year 2020 to take me. So I started my goody goody challenge. I mean my goody jar challenge. And I challenge you all to also get you get yourselves a goodie jar and what this jar consists of is everything good you can't put anything else in this jar but the things that you plan on doing having and completing throughout the whole year of 2020 and each time that you go in your goodie jar, you take out a message, a goodie message that you didn't put in your goodie jar. As a reminder, this is what you said that you wanted to do, or you wanted to have, or you wanted to complete in the year 2020. And remind yourselves of doing just that. Now put the goodie jar somewhere where it's visible all throughout the day to remind you that you need to remind yourself of your goodie jar. For me, like I said, I have three messages in here to remind me of my goodie jar. And the three things that I want to start in 2020. And where I want to be in 2020. Well, be and have. Let me put it like that. And also, what I want to complete. Guys, I know I'm probably all over the place, but you guys get it. Um, But I want to challenge you guys with this goodie jar challenge to challenge yourselves to do something that you didn't get to do or have or complete in 2019 making your business using your goodie jar to start in that direction of getting the things that you want or getting the things that you should have and completing whatever you started in 2019. I hope you all are able to take on to on this challenge. It's a pretty simple challenge. The only thing about this challenge is how much are you willing to sacrifice to get your challenge completed it can be done 
And I will update you guys on the three reminders that I have in my goodie jar. I will read them off. And I will follow up from this video starting in 2020. I will follow up. I'm giving myself a six month span or six months to have it completed or even before the six months. But there's three different ones that I challenge myself to in order to complete them. But again, I will be following up throughout this process uh, just to show not just myself, but anybody that if you really want it and you want it bad enough, know that you can have it because it was something that you had in mind or had in your heart or even in your spirit that you wanted to fulfill. But for whatever reason, something else got in the midst of it or you put it off or to go take care of this or go take care of that. But we're almost at the end of 2019. Less than 20, 28 hours, 30 hours, give or take. I don't know what time it is right now, guys. But give or take less than 30 hours. We don't want to do no excuses at the end of 2019. We want to start making solutions going into 2020. So what do you say, guys? If you all are on board for this goodie challenge, you all can leave a comment down below and let me know if you all want to take on that challenge. I'm expanding it to any and everybody. Uh who wants to challenge themselves uh, to the goody jar and fulfill your dreams for 2020. Okay, guys. Otherwise, I'll be rambling on. It's a pleasure to be to talk to you guys. And oh, by the way, <laughs> I didn't mean to laugh like that guy. But then again, I did because it's a good feeling. I want to thank each and every last one of my fam twos. Day ones, middle ones, and the new ones. Thank you guys so, so much. From the bottom of my heart, I thank you all for the 200 supporters that I received before the year 2020. It just lets me further know that God has ha has me on the right path. And I'm hoping, not just for myself, but for my fam too, that God will give each and every last one of you all all the hearts of all the desires of your hearts for 2020. And we're going to take 2020 by storm. It's time to change the game in YouTube, y'all. And we're changing it for the better. So we're going to walk with a purpose, y'all. And we're going to walk into our destiny. But I want to thank you all again for the 200 supporters. I appreciate it. Uh, I wouldn't continue this without you guys so mm, thank you all i really appreciate each and every last one of you all but i'm gonna get off of here guys but before i go you guys know that i never want to leave my videos without leaving them on a positive note and you guys know the word that i use is power i'll take the p for pressure i'll take the r to release that pressure but I want to share the OWE with you guys because you owe it to yourselves to be the best you you can be. And remember, God loves you and I love my fam too. 
You guys stay safe. Stay blessed out there. And I'll see you all on my next video. Love you guys. Thank you.